Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Mother 2. Ness, sir. Are you staying here tonight? Thanks for being so generous to tips. You never gave me a tip. Never mind. <laughs> Alright, I'm pretty sure we have to go to the cafe. Evil taxi! Chris, the car! Oh, no, wait, sorry. It's a mad taxi. <laughs> no, I'm crying. Okay. Cool. I'm powerful enough to be able to beat the shit out of a car. Oh my god, I'm almost level 40. <laughs> I have life up... What is that? Which one is... Is this Omega? Hang on. Hang on. Greek alphabet. Okay, so obviously we have alpha and beta. Sigma. Okay. So that is Omega. Cool. Uh, the shield that uh, Paula has that protects us from other psychic attacks is a Sigma shield. Um, what is Gamma? Gamma seemingly doesn't exist. Huh. Uh, this... Oh, no, wait, there's Gamma. That is Gamma. Okay, so this is Gamma. Completely restores the HP of one person for only 13 psychic points. Incredible. Annoying Reveler? Alright. Pretty sure we go to the cafe. There's a loud noise outside. Must be the seventh inning stretch. And the fans are singing, take me out to the ball game at the stadium. What? There's a loud noise outside. Oh! He doesn't look like a nice man. There's a person lying on the ground. I wonder if he's... he's... Ooh, I don't like seeing a corpse lying around. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to go like that. I'm glad it wasn't me. <laughs> He's breathing. Has he just been playing too hard? Don't cut in front of me. If you give me something, I'll let you have my spot. Uh, sure. I don't give a shit about skip sandwiches. Are you sure? Yes. All right, take my place. <laughs> Oh, shoot, Ness? Can't see too well. Everything's blurry. You are Ness, aren't you? Me, who met Tucson, Everdred from Berglund Park. You must remember, I'm the best thief around. That car painter in Happy Happy Village was hiding something. <laughs> Strange. Stole it. Thought about selling it in the big city. Old city wise, man. Called it Manny Manny. The strange colored doll looking thing. Oh, I'm in pain. And. But it totally tricked me and stole it from me. He tricked a thief. He wanted me out of the way because I knew know his secret. He gets his evil power from that statue. This. The only ones. At the cafe. Check behind the counter. I said I'd tell you only once, but if you insist, I'll tell you once more. <laughs> Do you want to hear it again? No. 
before I go, here's my last haiku poem. When on your way out, be sure that you say goodbye and lock the door tight. This is my final request. Don't follow me. I must be on my way. Whoa. So long. <laughs> what? <laughs> is that man going to... to... Don't you feel better since you had the chance to talk with your friend? I helped you find him. He started stared right at me. Ooh, it was scary. Do you know him? You must be a dangerous kid. I'll bet you're on your way to Jackie's Cafe right now. He should really go to the hospital like other sick people do. He's not dead. I thought he may have passed on. Hm. Check behind the counter. What? Oh no. No, that's right. I am the host here. There's fire. The robo pump. Don't start counting down. Ow. That's just like Final Fantasy 4 when like you fight Bahamut and it's just like five. <laughs> What? Foresight? Are you still sleeping? This is Moonside. Yes, that's wrong. I am the hostess here. Yes is no, and no is yes. Makes perfect sense in Moonside. Yes, that's right. I am the host here. No, that's wrong. I am the hostess here. What? Foresight? Are you still sleeping? This is Moonside. Hmm. Do you understand all this? Yes. No? You don't? Yes? You don't? Tell you the truth, neither do I. Yes. Good. I'm glad you get it. Abstract art. Abstract art is attacking! It's fighting back. Level 35. Welcome to Moonside. Welcome to Soonmide. Moonwell Ot Kos me. Hello and goodbye. Goodbye. Hello, and goodbye. Hmm. Like an invisible wall. Protein drink. Dolly's clock. Weird. Okay. 
three, two. Thank God. All right. I'll tell you what I hate in this world. That steak. The color, the smell, the taste, the texture. Hey you, you're drooling. Hello, and goodbye. The Mani Mani statue is up ahead, but I'm gonna stop you right here. Don't even think about getting past me, because you aren't with a guy whose eyebrows are connected, and who also has a golden tooth. What? Huh? How about I sharpen you? I just love sharpening. You don't want me to sharpen? Didem unsi demun. Welk, welk, um, welk. Um, um. I don't like this place. Hey, parking meters. And you're walking around. Ha ha ha, that's so funny. Welcome to Moonside. I will send you first and then you second to the hospital. Oh, hey, the hospital. So you may not believe it, I'm a healer. I can examine each one of you. Yes, please. How dare you, like, try to trick me like this. Yes means no, no means ness. Or do you already know that? No. Ah, you knew it. That's good. I was just wondering. Hello, and goodbye. Night pendant. Help. Must be equipped on your body. Absorbs the light of a flash attack. Yes! Oh, and goodbye. No problem here. I spy with my little eye, Alakazam. I see a country in summer and a big silver ball. You're burnt, but you're fine. That is what I see. Handbag strap. Used as a whip during battle, the enemy takes enough damage to stop moving for a short time. Gone after one use. Hmm. Hello and goodbye. Goodbye. Shall I? Yes. Welcome to Moonside. Welcome to Moo 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 Inside. Before the soup gets cold, we must care for Mani Mani. Before the knife gets rusty, we must care for Mani Mani. Yes. Then goodbye. Okay. Can you see me? Aha, you can't. You're definitely not from around here. Hee <laughs> hee, get going now. Here's your hat. That's... No, haha, you can, eh? Hey, hey. You become a real moon sightian, haven't you? What the? You're looking for some kind of door? Well, you're not gonna find one. Well, you are going to find one, so get on my face. I have no patience when people interrupt me when I'm busy doing nothing. Hee-hee-ha, <laughs> it's me! You can see me, right? There's something interesting about you, so I'm going to follow you. Don't worry, though. <laughs> if you get into a fight, I'll stay out of it. You can't see me, right? Hi, how are you doing? From the looks of things, I would say you're doing good. Do you need anything? 
Alaska. This is the Dark Moon Hotel. One sleep period is $150. You want to sleep? No. Fuck. No is yes. No, yeah, that's fine. Good morn, uh, not morning. Here in Moonside, it's always the middle of the night. This is the headline from tonight's Moonside Press. Money, money is always money, money at money, money with all money, money, money. Dad. Yes, it's your dad. I deposited a ton of money. I would love to record. Continue. Okay. Yuck, yuck. Hey, don't you wish you had a gold tooth like mine? Give me a smile, hey? Everyone is someone, don't you think so? No. Wahaha. Hee hee hee. Uh, hey. Yo, don't you think my eyebrows rock? Check them out, they're connected. This is HP drops to zero. Jeff's HP drops to zero. Making sure that didn't actually do that. Hello, and goodbye. Money, money statue is up ahead, and you're going to stop. Right here. Huzzah, you really surprised me. You're the man whose eyebrows are connected and who has a golden tooth. How about we dump these kids and get something to drink? Perfect. Good. Don't do anything to me. I am... I am... Monotoli. It is a golden statue that you have seen before. Let's go ahead and just try to kill this thing. Paralysis? Damn. Hang on, I can still sigh. <laughs> Perfect. This is level 40. Oh, baby! The Money Money statue was actually a device that created illusions. The illusion device was destroyed. So where the hell are we? You were wandering around the warehouse with a vacant, faraway look in your eyes. Were you daydreaming? Hello, this is Apple Kid. I've come up with another wacky invention that I think has real potential. Maybe you won't, but anyway, it's called the Gourmet Yogurt Machine. It makes many different kinds of yogurt. Problem is, right now, it can only make trout-flavored yogurt. So I'm making the machine delivered to you via Express, Escargo Express. It's coming neglected class. Hopefully you'll get it soon. Yeah, everything is kaboom. I've got some problems here. Gotta go by. What? You shouldn't drink espresso. It'll stunt your growth. And quit hanging around here. What? I'm not a delivery man. I can't remember if we've met. Palorama just finished fasting and now wants to meet you at the west end of Dusty Dunes Desert in a cave with lots of monkeys. I'll use my teleportation to buy. Crunch. Oops. Crunch. Oops. Greetings. I'm Escargo Express's neglected class. Ooh, I just got here from the Dusty Dune Desert. 
It was the sunbathing guy. He told me about a cave with a lot of monkeys, or was it orangutans? Anyway, he said, well, uh, I forgot. Yep, I forgot. Actually, I forgot the stuff I was supposed to deliver, too. I think it was some weird machine to make trout-flavored yogurt. Yeah, I forgot it at the desert. Not going back that way, so don't ask me to get the package. I mean, it's your package, right? So you go get it. Go on, get out of there. Maybe that thing I forgot is important to you, so have a good time in the desert. Hello. I heard you talking about trout-flavored yogurt. I'm a maid who serves Mr. Monotoli, and I'm looking for trout-flavored yogurt to give to our special guest. If you know anything about it, please tell me. I've been searching and searching. So much just happened. Oh, no, mess. Oh, I'm paralyzed still. Damn it. Restore feeling. Revive a friend. Hey. Perfect. Very punctual about time and careful with money. I don't look like it, though. No problem. Oh, come on. I've got the goods, G. What are you looking for? Mood boy jerk. You can't do that to me. Six baby. Yeah. 
Alrighty. Do you have a skip sandwich? I'll move away if you give me one. No. I won't move. I'm gonna eat a picnic lunch. Ay, ay, ay. Whoa, there's a wet towel inside. Hey, there's a pizza inside. Doesn't it feel hot in here? There's a hamburger. There's a ruler. I'm Mon... Oh, no. I want to eat a tasty pizza. Do you have one? Yes. Mm. It's a pizza! Somewhere amongst all these rooms, you should be able to attain Dragonite. Do you think Dragonite is really made from dragons? By the way... I'll give you a fresh egg. You run out, just come back. I'll give you as many eggs as you want. You have too much stuff? Damn it. I'd like to have a protein drink. side.
I want to measure something. Finally, I can measure my own tail. One of my friends can use the teleport. What? You've never heard of it? Then I'll give you King Banana. That didn't make sense, did it? But anyway, I'm attractive, don't you think? I got the King Banana. Alright, and then we need a fresh egg. I am Man K Man. Interesting thing is the King Banana. What? Are you gonna give me a present? I've died and gone to Monkey Heaven. I love Talarama the most. He's a friend of the monkeys. He's a song I made for him. Hmm. Yes, I have so many hamburgers. Please take them. Bag of Dragonite! I love hamburgers. A flame pendant. I love hamburgers. Please take all of these hamburgers. It's a broken tube inside. Fresh egg. neutralizer inside. Okay, what is some of this? You sprinkle the powder on one of your friends during battle, the friend will turn into a dragon and attack all enemies. Excuse me? Must be equipped on your body. It protects you from fire attacks. Okay, that makes sense. Items for Jeff. When used during battle, the item resets the abilities of all creatures, friend or enemy, to their normal levels. Any changes that had taken place due to psychic and such is neutralized. It also neutralizes all shield friend or enemies that were in effect. Remember, the abilities that I am talking about are offense, defense, guts, etc. Tube. Broken tube shaped item. This genius Jeff should be able to fix it. Should be.
knew we would need it eventually. I've been waiting for you. The truth of space and time moves through the universe like a wave. Truth speaks through space and matter, and makes itself known to human beings. I was waiting for you, and you came. This was destined to happen. In truth, all is predetermined. Ness, Paula, Jeff, and Pooh. When these four powers gather, twisted space will bring back peace to the world. Do you understand? It doesn't matter. Proceed as you wish. Open the treasure box and take what is inside with you. Did you come in search of this? Someone left it behind in this hole. You cannot carry anything else. Why don't you get rid of something that you do not need? You will need this, the gourmet yogurt machine. I will. Brain food lunch. A couple life noodles. Did you come in search of this? Someone left it behind on this hole. Jeff got the yogurt dispenser. The adventure that lies ahead won't be easy. I'll give you a special skill to help you move space as you wish. Learn the skill from the monkey over there. Would you like to learn the special power? Yes. Ha ha ha. That's wonderful. Speak to the monkey over there. I'll teach you teleportation. Let's go outside. Alright, level 41. Follow me, like this way. Okay, I'll do a teacher's demonstration. If you learn this, you can go anywhere you've been previously. You can go there instantly. The skill can't be used in room or underground, though. I went to Foresight and returned. I showed you the basic straight course, where you can build up enough sp But you can also build up enough speed while turning if you have enough room. Okay, why don't you try it, young man? Let's learned how to use psychic teleportation. Yahoo! Great, okay, the teacher is going home now. Thank you. 
Yeah, run away. Idiot. <laughs> oh, I can go back to Winters. Let's not do that, though. Ow! Bastard truck. asking around for trap favored like yogurt but what do you have a yogurt dispenser may i have it before he could answer she took the yogurt dispenser now i can make trout flavored yogurt for my guest you're so kind i'll make some for you my room's on the 48th floor don't forget to drop by my room's on the 48th floor don't forget to drop by all right now we can do this perfect Quiet, aren't you, Ness? Mr. Monotoli's maid, Electra, told me about you. I'll take you to Mr. Monotoli's office on the 48th floor. Only you may go. Speaker code, please. Say your code in 10 seconds. Nine, eight. Which way is progress? 
the code, please. 37. Sudden guts pill. TikTok. That's scary. Vitality capsule. Master Pokey's cool. He gave me something the other day and said this is fit for a maid. Okay. Ping. Clankety, clankety. Rattle, rattle, dwarf. Squeak, tweet, tweet, clank. Clumsy robot. <laughs> okay. What happened to all my bombs? Thank you. Yes! Yes! Guys rushed into the room. It was the Runaway Five. Lucky quickly ducked behind the robot. I flipped the switch and it stopped. <laughs> Jeez, what a loser robot! It was so easy to stop. That was quick thinking. Clumsy robot stopped moving. Forty-two. Perfect. We don't have any money. We are strong, however. We would like to pay you back. We'll help you in whatever way we can. Let's break into the room next door. Except I need to go to the bathroom first. I thought that I heard a girl's voice. Room next door seems suspicious somehow. Stop! That's enough! Please stop! I give up! I really do! Bear won't attack you. He's stuffed. Ness, you finally made it. I'm fine. I believed you'd come and save me. Mr. Monotoli isn't really a bad person. Take some time to listen to him. Look at my skinny arms, thin body, and gray hair. I've become so weak since I lost the Mani Mani statue. I'm sorry I kidnapped Paula. I haven't done anything to her. Paula is a nice girl. Paula, return to Ness. I'm sorry, I've created so much trouble for you. Paula joins you. 
I'll tell you everything. Mani Mani statue creates an illusion. It attracts evil spirits and weakens your heart. Power scared me so much, I hid the statue in the warehouse at Jackie's Cafe. I often went there to pray. Cryptic words that appeared to me when I was in the illusion. Ness, your name appeared in the cryptic messages. Stop Ness and do so by your own hand. Or don't let them go to Summers. Or make sure they know nothing of the pyramid. I don't fully understand the messages. Someone obviously doesn't want you to go to Summers. Evil, I guess, or something. I could hear the name. Anyway, the evil side would be in trouble if you visit Summers. Oh, on the contrary, you should definitely go to Summers. Especially because they don't want you to make it there. Would you like to hear the whole story again? No. Summers is located across the ocean. Take my helicopter. I'll open the door to my heliport. You must go on, Ness. This is your destiny. Paula, it's time we said goodbye. Take care. Ness, you pinheaded idiot! You're just a half step too slow! I'm getting out of here. Since Monotone Lee has become a plain old man again, I have no more use for him. This helicopter will really come in handy. Looks like you're the world class loser again! He took the helicopter. I hope he's okay. Oh, I was a little dizzy, but now I'm okay. To get to Summers, we need to go back to Threed. Yep, somehow I know that's where we must go. Hmm. Wow, you guys did a lot while I was in the bathroom. <laughs> you want to get to Threed as soon as possible? We can take you to Threed in our tour bus. I'll get the bus and wait for you just outside the building.
Hello, how are you? This is Apple Kid. I think I'm a real genius. In fact, I know I'm a genius. Why? Well, I just discovered the primary enemy of you and all of humanity. We have to fight and defeat this being. To do so, we need to invent a machine called the Phase Distorter. I've got to find the wandering scientist, Dr. Andonitz, and make the distorter, so I may be gone for a while. Later. Are you a friend of the Runaway Five? Would an autograph be asking for too much? Yes. I don't mean your autograph, silly. No, not at all. No. I tried. When I'm off duty for my bodyguard job, I still have a lot of pent-up energy. But don't worry, I won't come after you. Unless you're kind of itching for a fight. A lot has happened to me. I had to try and sort it all out. Thinking is tough for me. He's honest. <laughs> this elevator's going down. Look, don't stand behind me and stare at my hips. Wait. I'm eight! Leave me alone! <laughs> Hope my salary stays the same. You don't understand. This is a huge concern of elite businessmen like me. How else am I supposed to afford the three yachts that I just bought? Last night, there was a solitaire tournament. Da oh. Hello, this is Orange Kid. Sorry I haven't called lately. I'm still working on the way to change boiled eggs into raw eggs. I'm taking longer than I thought. You can really work at it, though. Talk to me later. Okay, you can get on the bus now. All right, on to three. All right, we made it. Sorry we couldn't do more for you. Remember though, we're on your side. When you're having a tough time, just think of our songs and imagine the Runaway Five singing somewhere far, far away. Well, why did you need to come back here? Must have forgotten some very important item of gadget here. Oh, uh, well, how's that for a guess? Am I close? Well, you don't have to tell me. See you later and good luck. that you beat the zombie leader.
Alrighty. Doesn't this house look good? You can buy it for only $7,500. That has ocean view and everything. Do you want to buy it? Sure! Thank you. It's all yours now. Take some time and relax. Hey, you've got your own place now. Sure has an ocean view. I'm pretty sure there's... Yep, there it is. Like the whole reason for it. The picture's taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius, if I do say so myself. Okay, get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera. Ready, say, fuzzy pickles. Wow, what a great photograph. It'll always bring back the fondest of memories. Wow. House is in such good condition. Can't be that cheap. I saw you once before, just for a second. You know my fiancé? My fiancé loves to chew gum. He went to visit Dr. And in its lab, but he hasn't returned yet. I want to go there so I can get him home. But without him, I can't cross Lake Tess. Pre-kiko-kiako. I'm really worried about... Worried that the mad doctor will use him in a crash test. Okay, so it's just a non-stick now. We're good. Oh, wait, the great charm. enough room. I told you the wrong fan name before. I said Runway fi Fire. The real name is Runaway 5. My girlfriend corrected me. Came from four side by bus. Buffalo? Oh yeah, I saw lots. It's awesome. Reed Sunset Hotel, one stay, sure. Good morning. 
I brought a mistake and brought the three star by accident. But let me read it to you anyway. Zombie gives birth to Hawk Child. <laughs> yeah, right. And now I'm scared. Now I'm scared I'm gonna see zombie hawks. Painted over all the damaged parts of the Skyrunner. Now I wonder how you start this thing. I want you to stay, but if you can't, so long. Thanks for every good little old thing. Ah, here's the problem. It's not too tough to fix. Hang on for a sec or two. There. That should do it. Now if we board, the Skyrunner will take us back to Winners. With Dr. O and Annette's help, I can modify the machine to fly to Summers. If Dad, I mean Dr. and Annette's, is not available, I'll have to figure it out by myself. Anyway, let's get back to the lab in Winners. That's it. Go, machine, go! Yeah. There's a present. Wonder if I should bother with it. There's four side. Thanks for taking my care of my husband the other day. Oh yes, we finally tied the knot. Honey, don't just stand there with your mouth open. Say hello. So, you pass by a cave north of Stonehenge. Don't you ever wonder what's inside? Can't seem to stop thinking about it? Go and see what's there. We're gonna get out of here. We're still newlyweds, you know. Bye-bye. You surprise me. You're Ness, aren't you? Jeff wets the bed sometimes, but other than that, he's a good boy. Take care of yourself and Jeff. Oh, Monkey said there's a cave north of Stonehenge. I've known about it for a long time. Locals call the area Rainy Circle. I haven't been there. Wonder what's inside the cave. I, uh. Huh, I understand. Uh, while you're checking out that place, I'll work on remodeling the Skyrunner. Yes, yes, my co-worker Bigfoot dislikes violence. Such a nice guy, and he loves people. He often shares his beef jerky with me. May I help you? What would you like? Bottle of deluxe water? Please come again. Hey, Ness, it's your dad. I want to record everything and continue. Perfect. And mom. Ness, don't say a word. I know exactly what you're thinking. You're such a brave boy. Ha ha ha. Bye. Okay. <laughs>
How dare you be up there? What are you doing? I can't do... Oh. It just don't look very bright. Let me explain. This is a... finally got here. This is the fourth your sanctuary location, but it's mine now. Take it from me if you dare. Room. Vulnerable to fire. Damn. Thank God, he's like solo targeting Jeff for some reason. I appreciate it though. Yes. You won. Next is 43. Oh, baby. All is 36. Well, it's 37. Hey, fire. Gamma. 38, Jeff. Hello, it's your dad. You've been out for a while. Go away. Ness caught a whiff of steak, but just for a second. Ness the soundstone recorded the melody of the rainy circle. Alright. Strong crocodile and the elder bats. Good. Good. 
Perfect. 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 <laughs> Very aloof, aren't you, big guy? Ow. That's a lot of damage. Level 38. F is 39. Okay. Mighty Bear 7. Oh, Ness! Jeff went to bed sometimes. Take care of yourself, Jeff. Hmm. Think you found something out? I finished remodeling the Skyrunner. You can leave for summers whenever you wish. Shouldn't break this time. Well, maybe. Alrighty.
The guy next to me is really bugging me. He's following me around. Wake up in the morning, fall in love, eat lunch, fall in love, and at night, fall in love again. That's my dream life. Oh, you're scaring people. Quit it. <laughs> Quit it. <laughs> I wonder why such serious looking kids as you would come to this resort town. You guys are spoiling the atmosphere. You look so serious. You're in summer as a dream paradise. Relax and have some fun. I'm just trying to take a nap in the shade. Don't bother me. If there's anyone else on the beach. Yep. Don't talk to me. My mind is a complete blank. Are you from Eagle Land? If you like adventure, this isn't your kind of place. You should travel across the sea to Skaraba from Toto, Port Town. Pictures taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius, if I do say so myself. Okay, get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera. Ready, save, fuzzy pickles. Wow, what a great photograph. It'll always bring back the fondest of memories. Wow! Got some real spectacular things. What would you like? I don't have money. You should really eat it. I don't. I'm scared. <laughs> Only a tanning pro like me is able to get an actual suntan on the palms of his hands. Hotel de Summer, 150 per night for a single room. The sky is blue and the sun is high. The prices here are so high it'll make your face turn blue. That's Summers. I just got my picture taken. <laughs> Pictures taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius if I do say so myself. Okay, get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera. Ready, save, fuzzy pickles. Wow, what a great photograph. It'll always bring back the fondest of memories. Wow! Thank you again, Pokey. Uh, Mr. Ness. Yeah, I fucking heard you. Alright. Rizzi Rizosha Richmonde, and I'm the assistant manager. Sorry, sir, but I'm afraid that we do not have any reservations under your name. However, we can offer you a room at 450 a night. Would you be interested? <coughs> sure. Hope you enjoy the wonderful ocean view. Hey, this is a pretty nice room. Ah, sir, are you already on your way to the beach? Here's this morning's headlines of the Daily Summers. People were reported missing one after another in our sister city winters. Don't get too excited about this town. It's a tourist trap. Everyone seems to be nice, but they're just doing it for the money. I know from experience. I can't believe you pronounce hotel as hotel. What? In this country, hotel is pronounced hotel. What? Then in your country is otter pronounced as otter? How would I know these things? Okay. Hmm. I heard the security guard in the Garaba Cultural Museum isn't very nice, but he can be helpful. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Okay. <laughs> Do 
you have a relaxing sleep. The sound of the ocean waves didn't disturb you, I trust. Thank you again, Poke uh, Mr. Ness. Sky's blue and the sun is high. The presses are so high, it'll make your face turn blue. Restaurant. So where's your mom and dad? You mean you kids came in here all by yourselves? Well, I, I can make your order to go. What can I get for you? Chef special. Pasta de summer. Kraken soup. Why is that so expensive? Royal iced tea. Looking forward to seeing you again. I'll have a braised boa over minced baby leeks. Oh, you're not the waiter. A boa? Like a boa constrictor? Steak? Pleased, we do not have such trash on our menu. I'll kill you. I <laughs> Wait! Ooh, sorry. You know, I can't quite describe it. Drinking glass after glass of iced coffee is, well... <clears throat> oh, excuse me. I like iced coffee as well. Stop! <laughs> Pictures taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius if I do say so myself. Uh, all right, and get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera, ready, safe, fuzzy pictures. Oh, what a great treat! What a great photograph. It'll bring back the fondest of memories. I have fake teeth, so I like soft foods. Not like rocks or stones. They're too hard. Hey, talking to people at another table in a restaurant is like breaking into the room and checking their drawers for valuables. Yeah, other people on important adventures do such things, but you have to admit that it is, it is bizarre. I like the atmosphere in this restaurant. They have good food, too. Their food costs as much as my weapon that gave me plus ten to strength. <laughs> Ain't no way I'm buying shit here. Hey, hey, stop putting your grimy fingerprints all over my car, you little punk. I'm actually a surfer, but you can't surf at this beach. Do I become a porter so I can get tips from all the old folks? That's a... a crazed sign. It tried hypnosis. Jeff! How annoying. Why are you wandering around? Summers is a posh resort made for adults. There's a big monster living in the sea between here and Scaraba. Scaraba? I've seen a picture of it. I right, welcome to my store. What could you need? Oh, goodness. Oh. My god. Thank you. 
Wow. Okay. Well, we have it. We have the best equipment. Boy, was that expensive. Bum, bum, bum. Club Stoic. This is not the Stoic Club. Please be on your way. It's a Muna bird. The guy next to me is really bugging me. He keeps following me around. Have a fantastic vacation. At least until you run out of money. Hotel du Sonnex. If you're bored, go check out the Garaba Cultural Museum. It may be helpful to you. They have a hieroglyph from a pyramid. A pyramid, you say? Right now, part of the Scaraba Cultural Museum is being remodeled. You still want to enter? Yes. Three dollars per person. Okay, since you kids look like you would study hard, you may enter. Free of charge. Oh wait, I can't do that. Goodbye. It's pissed. You should know better. You cannot get in without paying admission. It's three dollars per person. Nine dollars too expensive for you, or are you just not interested in ancient culture? You don't even have nine dollars? If it are up to me, an oddity like you would be exhibited in the museum. Wow! That's harsh. But you're an enemy. I think the enemy might have tried, been trying to run away from me just because of how much more... Why would Mr. Spoon from the Foresight Museum try to call me? I bet he just wants to brag about something. Well, let him try. I wonder what he wants to tell me. Bah. Dare him to try and upstage me. No, pardon me. I was just talking to myself. <clears throat> Ram Raisin the Third's Casket. Toten Carmen's Casket. Ram Raisins the Fourth's casket. Ram Raisin the Fifth's training. Training pot. Toten Carmen's pencil box. Thought a chubby kid about your age here. Looked like he was awfully wealthy. He was being extravagant. His lunchbox. This room is being remodeled, so I can't show it to you. I can't, well. I usually don't show this room. Once you hit adulthood, you'll understand. I do, however, like jewelry. Perhaps a little, shall we say, under the table deal would be in order. Since the hieroglyph display is closed, people haven't wanted to visit. Goreva Cultural Museum. Hieroglyph. Exhibition currently under reconstruction. Now wait a minute, youngster, I could give you a great hint for just $150. Another nice day. Summers always has sunny days. My cousin is a nurse in Tucson. She's not good at administering shots. The one she gave me was painful. Relax, take it easy, it's all in your head. A healthy mind is a healthy body. Yeah, tell everyone that it's all in their head. No, oh god. <laughs> East of here is the port town of Toto. No, no, I'm not a billboard. 
There's graffiti on the board. The handwriting is hard to read. Ness can eat my shorts. For a neighbor, he's a loser. Go to Scaraba. You need to cross the sea. However, a monster named Kraken lives in the open sea. He attacks ships that pass through. Are you scared? Across the sea, there's a town called Scaraba. Mysterious town. It's my dream town. Grave robber. I was scared of the pyramid in Scara Scaraba, so I didn't go in. But I tell people that I saw mummy-type monsters with my very own eyes. Do you know the Stoic Club in Summers? You need to call a secret number for a reservation if you want to get in. What? Yeah, I'll give you the secret number. I'll warn you, though. It's a strange place. Hmm. <laughs> Hello, Jeff. Oh, happy day. I finally got a hold of you. Oh, Jeff. Hi, it's me, Tony. I'm collecting players' names for a school project. You know, players just like you. That's right, you, the one holding the controller. Would you administer your name, please? Don't spell your name wrong. Thanks, game player. Thank you very much. Is this correct? I apologize for any trouble this may have caused you. Don't put my friend Jeff in any dangerous situations, okay? I worry about him. I really do. Well, talk to you later. Jeff, hope that you can... S I hope that I can see you again when you are feeling up to it. From Tony. Got that? Well, I've been on the phone too long. Gotta go. Good luck. Take care. So long. This time I'm really gonna hang up. Goodbye. Beep. Would you like a boat ride? Not sure. I don't feel like sending a ship out. I'm worried about my wife. I'm not afraid of the Kraken. I was totally ignoring her magic cake business. Uh, these days, she spends her time hanging out in a strange club. We no longer have any mutual interest to discuss. Is our relationship over? I don't want to go out to sea because of the Kraken. I mean, any normal person would feel the same way. Bow, now brown cow? What? If you come closer, I'll play the trumpet. Uh, I don't know how to play yet. Dinosaurs existed. I saw one. It had... It had been out of the underground when it dried out. Of course it was dead. Believe what I'm saying. I don't know why that's so funny. If you be heading to Scaraba, you ought to shop here. Things are expensive down there, so what are you looking for? Will you be needing anything else? Come again. Stoic Club. Hello, this is the Stoic Club. Oh, Ness, sir. Would you like to make a reservation? Certainly. We're looking forward to having you here. Thank you. Click. Beep, beep, beep. Didactically speaking, seminal evidence seems to ex explicate the fact that your reputation of entropy he supports my theory of space-time synthesis. Of course, I am irrefutably confident. You guys can envision the final collapse of... <laughs> hey, um... I'm pretty sure I've seen this before, but it's still... 
still caught me off guard. I need to take a picture of this. <laughs> oh, what do you mean? Okay, hang on. Take two. Okay. You guys can't envision the final collapse of capitalism? Incredible! <laughs> I finally awakened the inner me, the true self. The patrons of this club are able to share, stare into their own soul hard enough to burn a hole in their psyche. I'm now comfortable enough to stare at the real me, the true self, and burn the impression into my superego. I want to be in this comfort zone at any time, all the time, or at no time. My ID... My id is telling me. Hmm. I think it's a very complicated issue. Oh, sorry. I was sleeping. You know, I really want to eat some magic cake. It's a mysterious work of art. Can't get that cake out of my mind. There's only one woman who can make magic cake. She's hanging out in this club. Yeah, she's over there at the entrance. Anyway, the absolute irony is and study of self-identification is blah, 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 blah. I don't know what to do. You don't understand what what the hey... You don't understand what the hey everyone is talking about, do you? I don't either, but I try to be patient with the customers. They pay high prices just for a glass of water and a chance to have serious intellectual discussions. Actually, it's an easy business. You want a drink? They only serve water, though. The show? It's already started. Everyone stares at the stone on stage and philosophizes. Doesn't it sound stupid? What, what? Magic cake? You came all this way just to eat my magic cake? Yes. I see. Okay. Why don't you stop by a little cart out on the beach later? Start beating him to death <laughs> with a laser gun, a nonstick frying pan, and a bat. Incredible. Hey, we left a present. It was a chick. Ah, the tough guy has a chick. All right. Lotto de Resort. Who's gonna carry it? Yes, will. Hmm. Oh! I don't know who told you. You came from far off just to eat my magic cake? I thought making cakes would be the best career for me. Dig in. I used all leftover materials. This is a very special magic cake. Damn, it's over. <laughs> Thank you. 
Ness had a dream. It was a very clear and very strange dream. The Long in the Far East. The Palace of Pooh, the Crown Prince. Prince Pooh, the time has come. Now come for you to undertake your final trial. Go to the place of emptiness and endure this final test. I am praying for your success in this final stage of your training. Go quickly! Use the treasures of Dalam as you wish. Go in peace. Whoa! It's a couple life noodles. Wow! It was brain food. Wow! It was brain stone. Old treasure from Delon. Regular stone that enables you to concentrate without using your own brain. Accomplished just by you keeping this item. This is great because if you can't concentrate, you can't use PSI. Huh. He's already level 15. He knows Freeze and Thunder, Alpha and Beta. He knows Life Up and Healing Alpha and Beta. He knows Shield Alpha and Sigma. Cool. Are you a telephone? Hello? Is that you, Ness? Why are you disguising your voice like that? Who are you pretending to be? Oh, well, it's not a big deal. I suppose you need to have a sense of humor at a time like this. I deposited money. Prince Pooh, you're my favorite. <laughs> hmm. What is immortality? Is it the lasting life? Hmm. Oh, Prince Pooh, I'm surprised you're not in training. It seems like that's all you do these days. Why don't you take some time to play with me? I'm so lonely without you. Please come in. Look around the house as much as you want. There's a bottle of water. Incredible. Wait, like... Okay, it's re it's talking about recovering. It said increase, and I was just like, wait a minute. If I drink water, I'll get more max? No. Oh, Prince Pooh, do you have time to play with me? No. Ha, huh, I knew it. Training changed you. I'm jealous of your training. Yes. Happy me. Patty cake, patty cake. I just roasted some garlic and ate it. So the room still stinks. I heard that Prince Pooh is deeply into moo training. I want to help him if I can. Whoa, there's a jar of del sauce inside. Used by sprinkling it over food, it tastes good with any kind of food, thereby increasing the recovery power of the food. You know what you do, do er You know that you do do everything well, right? Do do? Oops. Say, Prince Pooh, are you still popular with the girls? Seems like it, but I'll just say no. You've been acting very serious lately. Yes. Heard you're living in a more serious lifestyle these days. 
Secrets Poo. You're such a hunk. Delam Restaurant. We accept money. Wish I could recover my PP just by drinking water, even though I have never seen him before. I n heard that Prince can do that. I guess I need more training. By the way, what is PP anyway? We serve water, rice, gruel, and other sorts of things. What would you like to do? Well, I have no food. Or I have no money. Goodbye. Please take care. Whoa, there's a bowl of rice gruel. Whoa, there's a bottle of water. Strange as they may sound, there are statues of rabbits blocking your way. As it may sound. This is Mew, the place of nothingness. People who train here must first clear everything from their mind. If you can make your mind blank and learn the true meaning of Mew, you'll pass through. Mew is Mew. You have nice eyes. You must be Prince Pooh. Long ago, I completed Mew training. I wanted to show you a higher level of intelligence. However, I'm still realizing and learning this high level. I'll see you again. So long. Ah, Prince Pooh. I'm a messenger from your master. He sent me to tell you that you must stop your meditation immediately. Prince Pooh, you must come back with me instead of staying in a place such as this. Your master wishes it. Please rise, Prince. Your Highness, you must give up this trial for now. Believe what I say. It is true. Prince Pooh, I am the spirit of your ancient lineage. To complete your trial, I am going to break your legs. You will lose the use of them. Do you accept this? Yes. So, Prince Pooh, you cannot walk, as your legs are broken. Next, I will tear your arms off. I shall take your arms and feed them to the crows. And the taking of your arms... Do you accept this? Ah, Prince Pooh. Without legs and arms, you can only lie there. Now, I'll cut your ears off. You do not mind me t my taking your hearing away, do you? Do you accept this? So, Prince Pooh. No legs, no arms, and no sound. By floating words through the air, I must ask you. Do you care if I take your eyes? Do you want to live in eternal darkness? I shall steal your sight. Do you accept this? So, Prince Pooh, now I can only communicate directly with your mind. Your mind is all you have left. In the end, I will take your mind. So you probably don't want to allow that, do you? So, you can't answer. You can't even move. Are you sad? Are you lonely? If, lo if you lose your mind, you also lose any feelings of sadness. Do you accept this? I will take your mind, Prince Pooh. Know that I will possess it. Prince Pooh, you have now completed your training. The old master must be so pleased. Hurry now and return to the palace. Cool.
What is immortality? I am proud. You have completed your Mew training. There is nothing more to teach you from the Holy Writings. Prince Poop, I shall relay a message to you from eternity. The evil entity that controls all wickedness is preparing for the greatest struggle of all time. The only ones who can challenge the entity are three boys and one girl. One named Ness is the leader of the four. One of the boys is you, Prince Poop. Now that you've completed your training, search out Ness at once. For all beings, for the Earth herself, I pray for growth in the might of the four. Whose level is now 16. I have Shield Beta. 17. I have Teleport. I have Teleport Beta? My name is Pooh. I'm the one who will fight beside you. I am the servant of Ness. I will obey Ness. Ness! My life is in your hands. Who joined you? Allows you to immediately return to a place where you have already been. You don't need a running approach to use this. It is also called the Tornado Teleport. Oh. can no longer make magic cakes. But it doesn't matter, because now I'm selling magic tarts! Which taste even better than magic cakes. I only have this. Oh. Reminded me of how much I love this job. Hmm. Alrighty. So, this would be right around the time that I stopped playing this game. <laughs> Damn it. Damn it. Who's level 19? How dare you?
You're back! Don't bother yourself with talking now. You look too tired. Mother understand these things. Eat some steak and scoot off to bed. Working through the night, Jeff fixed the broken tube. Became a hungry HP sucker. Don't want to go anymore. Good morning, everyone. Are you ready for your adventure? I think all of you are the bee's knees. Yes, I do. You're all so cool. Yes, you're hip. Alrighty. Ness that your dad, I deposited a very small amount of money. What happened to the money, Ness? What did you do to all of our money, Ness? Anyway, are you going to bed? Yes? Oh, why? Well, see to it. Alrighty. So... I am now at a point that I know nothing. <laughs> I don't know anything past this point. I remember getting poo in my party, and then I just dropped the game afterwards. So I am completely blind at this point, other than the very ending, because this is one of those games where it's just like, oh, you know, there, there's no way you don't know the ending to Earthbound. It's one of the most talked about video games of all time. <laughs> It's like you don't know what happens at the halfway point of Final Fantasy VII, or something like that. Uh, but yeah, that is going to be it for now. Uh, I have no idea how far I am. Well, considering I've done four Sanctuary points, I would say I'm halfway done. Which... Yeah, that's probably correct. <laughs> I'm probably about halfway done. A little more than halfway done. Uh, so yeah. If we're a little more than halfway done, and this is episode 5, then, you know, this is probably going to be a 10-part series. Something like that. Something like that. Anyway, doesn't matter. What matters is that next time we'll head back to summer and uh, figure out what to do next. Because I don't know. Um, but yeah, thank you all for watching. Especially if you got this far and stick around, because there's a lot more to come.